Praise the Lord. Good morning. Let's listen to today's devotional by Pastor Benedict James. Greetings in the most amazing name of Jesus Christ. Well, the topic for today's devotion is entitled Be it spiritual life or professional life. Never quit. The power of comeback against failures. For devotion, let's read from Psalm chapter 42, verse 5. Why are you cast down, O my soul? Hope in God, for I shall yet praise Him. Well, the university commencement speaker chosen has been the president of a large corporation. He was chosen for the occasion because of his success. Yet his speech, I beg your pardon, yet his speech came with the most unusual wish for the graduates. The speaker told the students sitting before him in the graduate gowns. He said like this, If I could have one hope for you as you go out into the world is this, I hope you fail. Yes, fail at something that is important to you. He went on to say how his own life has been one failure after another until he learned to see failure as an effective teacher. Well, many of the songs in Psalms, Book of Psalms, were born in seasons of failure. Sometimes we fail to really see the wonder of God's wisdom and strength until we grasp our breath in the exhaustion of our own strength and energy. No doubt, we will be disappointed if we fail, but we will be doomed if we do not attempt because of the fear of failure. Well, success is not measured by how we go up in life, but rather by how many times we bounce back when we fall down. It is this bounce back ability that derives or determines our success. Well, if we study history, we will find that all stories of success are also stories of great failures. But people don't see failures as the end of their destiny. All success stories, as I said, are of great failures. The only difference is that every time they fail, they bounce back. We see the life of Thomas Edison. He failed approximately 10,000 times while he was working on that light electricity. Young Beethoven was told that he had no talent for music, but he gave some of the best music to the world. Well, whether it is our Christian spiritual life or professional life, setbacks are inevitable. A setback can act as a driving force and also teaches humility. Let's look to the Lord in prayer. Lord, help us not to be disheartened because of failures or valley experiences, but help us to press on. Help us to press on forward, having you as our anchor in our life. In Jesus' amazing name we pray. Amen. Thank you for listening to today's devotional. God bless you. Have a blessed day. And always remember, Jesus loves you and cares for you.